Hi there, students. Off the wall. Off the wall. Um, this idea is off the wall, an off the wall idea. Off the wall means surprising, unusual, strange, different, often intentionally different, not conventional. So um, young people love the off the wall jokes that he tells. They're a bit zany, a bit crazy. Now, I think the question with off the wall is, is this positive or is it negative? And for me, generally, off the wall is a positive thing. You could use it in a negative sense to mean absolutely cra crazy, um, completely bananas. Um, uh, si silly. This book is s really strange. It's off the wall. It's so um, off the wall that um, mainstream people don't like it. So if somebody's off the wall, maybe they're crazy, maybe they're angry, um, or as well off the wall, an accusation without basis, without foundation. So the accusation that I'm stealing money from the organisation is completely off the wall. It's um, without basis. It's without any foundation. So for me, off the wall, an off the wall joke, it's eccentric, it's unconventional, it's different. Um, and it's quite a positive thing. It's thinking outside the box. Um, so something that's fun. His ideas may be off the wall, but they are very interesting. Yeah, I don't want something that's just the same as mainstream, the same as the status quo. I would prefer something that is more off the wall. Um, OK, so your ideas are generally a bit off the wall, but this one makes no sense. But then it, this idea of off the wall, um, if somebody's off the wall, they're a bit crazy, a bit angry. So your ideas are normally so off the wall that they're just not, they don't make sense. And an accusation is off the wall, is completely unfounded. Um, so generally, off the wall, extremely unconventional, but in a positive way. But it can go too far and um, be so off the wall that nobody likes it. Um, a zany, wacky, off the wall, off the wall, uh, strange person. Um, angry. The boss was really off the wall about the things that had been been written about him. So good or bad? For me, it's good. It's I think it's in the realms of good. But be careful with the uh, with the, the the context. Yeah, off the wall, highly unusual, bizarre, strange. And then you have to decide whether bizarre is good or bizarre is bad. Um, if you describe something that's off the wall. Yeah, it's unusual, it's strange, but in an amusing or an interesting way. Um, a person's ideas are off the wall. Maybe you're being critical because they're a bit mad or a bit stupid. Yeah, this, this idea is just so absurd. It's off the wall. It's just unreasonable. OK, so as we've seen, it could go both ways. Off the wall, new or unexpected in an unconventional way. Um, off the wall, very uh, eccentric, maybe a bit crazy, a bit oddball. Yeah, he's a, a rather off the wall personality. OK, so off the wall, formality. I think I'm going to give this a four in formality. Use it informally, use it in a semi-formal conversation. Semi-formal writing, just about, but no more. Um, and as to origin, well, maybe this is to do with the way that the, a ball bounces. Um, normally, the, a ball bounces quite regularly, but if you're playing various different uh, ball games, sometimes you get a really 
um, strange bounce and maybe that's the idea of off the wall so anyway enough if you enjoyed the video give it a rating subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon bye for now off the wall